everybody so welcome back to my channel today I am doing a prom hair and makeup inspired look I've never been to prom before but I just kind of went with what I would do if I was going to prom so I hope you all enjoy this video and let's go ahead and get started So my camera wasn't recording, but I did apply some e.l.f. eye primer and a Stila eyeshadow in the color Kitten on my highlight part of my eye just to kind of start the look off. Next I'm taking this eyeshadow by Bobbi Brown which is in the color Champagne and I'm just going to be applying that all over my eyelid just so we can kind of have a base color. I wanted to keep this look natural, pretty, but also have a bit of a smoky eye because a smoky eye can go with any prom dress that you are planning to wear. Then I just went in with some scotch tape and applied that because I really wanted to have a dramatic sharp edge to our eyeshadow. So I just applied that on both eyes and then I will be taking my Naked 2 palette by Urban Decay and taking my all time favorite black eyeshadow in Blackout which is a really pretty matte black and on the brush that the palette came with I'm just going to be kind of creating a area on my outer part of my eye full of black eyeshadow so as you can see I'm just kind of creating this kind of like cut outer corner kind of look. <laughs> also kind of filling that in as I go just keeping it mainly focused on the outer part of my eye and you're just gonna want to do the same thing on the other eye as well taking a fluffy blending brush by Real Techniques and I'm just going to go through and kind of buff out that black eyeshadow so it doesn't look so messy. I just kind of want to make it look a bit neater so I'm just going through and buffing that out. Not bringing it into the inner too much because we don't want a full on black eye so we just want to mainly focus on blending on the outer part of our eye. Depending on whatever color dress you plan on wearing to prom, you can use any color you want. I just went with black just because, like I said in the beginning, it goes with everything. So you really just gotta mix it up and kind of look at your dress and decide what colors will go best. And then here is what the look looks like once you remove the tape. So you just kind of have a black smoky eye and I just took some black eyeliner and applied that to my waterline. This one is by Urban Decay again in the color Zero which is a really black eyeliner. Again you don't have to make this look so dramatic and smoky but just from what I would do and what I like to do I like to make the look look really smoky and dramatic. Then I'm going back in with that Stila eyeshadow in the color Kitten and applying that to my lids just to give it a bit more of a sparkle and elegant look to it. And then just going through and blending out the edges so they kind of go together really well. took my e.l.f. cream eyeliner and created a cat eye and I also reapplied the tape to make it easier and then this is what it looks like. Then on a smaller Real Techniques brush I took the same color blackout and applied that to my lower lash line just to make the look even more smoky. I really like smoky eyes and I think smoky eyes are really perfect for prom in my opinion. And then I just went through and touched up the inner eye highlight again. 
Now time for some mascara. I'm using this one by Avon. This is the Mega Effects in Black, and it's a very unique looking mascara, as you can see by the brush, but it works really well to get a lot of length and volume, and it works really well for your bottom lashes as well. Bottom lashes, I think, are really pretty once they stand out, and I just think that would be perfect for any prom or dance that you plan to attend. And after you do that, you can either keep the mascara that you applied or you can apply false eyelashes. For false eyelashes, I'm using these ones by Fergie and they are just really, really elegant looking. And I took some lash glue and you wait until the glue is a little bit tacky like so. And then you just go ahead and apply the false eyelashes as close to your lash line as possible. I do have a more in-depth video on how to do this. If you want to go find that on my channel, it'll be in my makeup playlist. And to apply the false eyelashes, I just use tweezers because to me tweezers are just a lot easier to maneuver when you apply false eyelashes and they just look, these eyelashes are my absolute favorite. They just look really elegant and really pretty and they give the eye a really unique look and it just looks really, really pretty. I love these eyelashes. And for the lips, I went with the nude lip and I used this one by the Maybelline Nude Collection. This is in the color Bare All and it's a really nude lipstick and I just applied some pink lip gloss over top and for blush I use the Speech Cosmetics Blush Duo so I used this really pretty pink blush on my cheeks along with the highlighter as well it created such a gorgeous contour and color to your cheeks I absolutely love this blush duo Next, to make our makeup stay in place all night when you're dancing and enjoying, I'm just sprayed some e.l.f. makeup set spray all over my face to make sure that our makeup isn't going to sweat off during the night. Now for some hair, I wanted to go with something that was really pretty looking but also really simple because I don't like to go out too much with my hair so I just kind of created a little bit of volume in the back of my head so I just took a brush and took some hair and then I put it in little sections and pin the rest back and then once you do that you just take the hair that you have and just tease 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 like crazy to make the hair stand up and look crazy like so and you just do this for each section of your hair So once it looks like that, just take some hairspray and spray, spray a little bit on the part that you teased up and then kind of brush it down to make it look more neat looking. This is kind of similar to the bump it hairstyle that I used to do all the time, but this is just really elegant and you don't need a bump it to do so. And I just kind of teased around my side cut a little bit just to kind of show it off some more. And then just took my teasing comb and made it all even around. And then after you do that, just take some hairspray and set it all in place. This is a really simple hairstyle and really elegant and you can curl your hair with it and it would go really pretty with your prom dress, having a dance party. <laughs> then after you get everything in place and spray it, you are all finished. So here's the completed eye look. I really hope you guys enjoyed and I hope it was helpful for some of you. Like I said, I've never been to prom before so I just kind of used some inspiration just from pictures that I've been seeing. So here's everything together and I think it just looks really elegant and pretty. If you guys enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up. I would really appreciate it. Make sure you check out all my links down below so you can stay up to date with me. But until then, I will see you all very soon in my next one. Bye guys.